Hello, my name is Rick Ruth and I'm a member of the Bentley Technical Support Team. Do you know that block attributes in a DWG file can be displayed as tags or as item types in the MicroStation Connect Edition? We're going to look at the setting in the DWG Open Options that allow you to have block attributes displayed as tags or as item types. We're also going to see um, what happens when you open them up as a tag and what happens when you open them up as an item type and which should you choose. We want to go ahead into MicroStation and we want to go ahead and browse to a DWG file. We want to hit the Options button to get to the DWG Open Options and under Advanced there's a setting now in Connect that says Block Attributes as Tags. If we check this on the block attributes in the DWG file will be displayed as tags in MicroStation. So let's go ahead and hit OK and hit Open and open that file. Here's an AutoCAD block with some attributes. If you hover over the attributes you'll see that they're shown as a tag. You can double click on the tag and the tag editor dialog box opens. Uh, the name here would be the actual name of the block attribute the value would be the value that's displayed in your drawing and you can turn display on or off. Another option you have is to go ahead and select the block, go on the home tab, go to properties. Now in the properties dialog box you'll have your shared cell that we selected. Under there you'll have your associate elements and in there is your three tags that are part of that AutoCAD block. If you uh, select any of the tags you can scroll down to contents and you can get the name of the tag set which is the same as the a block name you can also get the tag name the tag type and the value now let's look at the option of opening the same drawing and having the block attributes open as item types so we want to go file close Another way of getting to the DWG Open Options is to right click on the DWG file and select Options. We get the same Open Options dialog box. Under Advanced we go to Block Attributes as Tags. This time we're going to unselect it. When we uncheck Block Attributes as Tags they're no longer going to be opened as tags and they're going to open up as the default item types. So we're going to hit OK. We're just going to go ahead and open that same file. And then now you'll see that the uh, block attributes have the gray background similar to a field and they're actually item types. So if we select the DWG block and go to properties, you'll see here our shared cell. If I expand that out, you'll see items and here's the items for the title block and in there is the name of the block attribute and the value so you can go ahead and edit the value of the block attributes once they're displayed as as item types the other option that you have is to go to the attach ribbon go to item types and open up the item types dialog box in the items type dialog box you're going to see DWG attribute definitions and under there you're going to see the name of our block which is named title block you can expand that out and you'll see each of the block attributes listed if you click on them to the right you'll get the properties of that block attribute which you can go ahead and change uh, some of these values now there are some uh, distinctive advantages of opening a DWG block with attributes as tags or as item types. If you're going to open up the DWG file and work on it directly you'd want to keep the block attributes as tags because they're the most compatible to an AutoCAD block attribute. If you're going to convert the DWG file to a MicroStation DGN file and at some point want to convert it back to a DWG file you're going to also want to keep it as tags. Also if you're going to convert the DWG file to a MicroStation DGN file and work on it in an older version of MicroStation you're going to want to keep them as tags.
Now, there is some advantages uh, using MicroStation Connect Edition uh, to bring these block attributes in as item types. In MicroStation Connect, item types have several advantages over tags. They can be used for display rules, creating reports, and for labels. So if the drawing is going to be used in MicroStation Connect and going forward, you're going to want to keep them as item types because you have more options. I hope this video is informative and please have a good day.